All right, welcome back to part three of our Core Keeper Let's Play. And this is an early access game on Steam, so it's not done yet. Um, but from what I've seen of it so far, I'm really enjoying it a lot, actually, which is pretty awesome. Looks like we got some of our seeds here that I want to plant really fast. Now, I know with this Let's Play, I said I wanted to figure out how to get fiber because there's fishing in this game and I want to be able to fish, darn it. Even though I didn't pick the fishing profession, which, you know, that's, that's neither here nor there. Let's see if I can, what do I want to take with me really quick? I want to take Maybe the shovel? I'm not sure if I really need it since I have the, the hoe, but I don't really need the hoe either. Oh, there was more seeds I could plant. Here, let's just do this really quick. Oh, I didn't want to eat the glow flower. Darn it, oh well. Oh yeah, that's right. I wanted to see if I could dig up sand and then, do I have to replace it with dirt? Like, what's the point of the digging up the sand? What can it do? Clear some more of this out. Okay. Let's get... Oh, no. That wasn't what I wanted to do at all. That was. So you can't walk on it if you've dug it up. I don't think I can hoe it. Yeah, I can't. So I must have to dig up, like, dirt from another section. So let's... Okay. Was that dirt ground? Dirt ground. Okay. Let's get these off my bar real quick. Now we can put these in, right? Yeah, so you can transfer ground from sections, I guess. Although, that's really weird, because then you can't walk on it. I don't understand the purpose of that, but okay. Maybe terraforming? I still don't fully get it, but that's fine. There we go. No, I want the glow flower. And we'll refill that real quick before I... What is... Oh, yeah, these are ready for harvest. Bomb peppers. All right, there. Our gardening now is done for a little bit, hopefully. <laughs> Maybe. Root seed, glow tulip seed, bomb pepper seed. All right, let's get rid of these seeds. I just want all my seeds planted and then I'm gonna figure out how to get fiber. So let's see, bomb pepper, glow tulip. There we go. Oh, I locked myself out of the house there for a second. We'll put that up and that up. Cause I really, I don't understand the point, but whatever, it works. Uh, let's see, I've got bridges. Uh, I don't know what else I need. Oh, could we, can you make, oh, there's more copper. Can you make something with the sand? That's what I'm curious about. Like, what's the point of having the sand? Is it just ground? Is it just walls? Can you make something with it? Like, I don't think you can. Oh yeah, I could make copper, pieces of copper armor now. Anyway, fishing pole, fiber. I need to stay focused. Stay focused. Fishing poles, fiber. I need to figure out how to get fiber. This looks like grassy land, but I don't know if you can... Do I need my shovel for that? Let me need my shovel. Is that how you get... No, I don't want that to come up. There we go. Shovel. Is this how you get fiber? Or is it just dirt? Turf ground. No. It's not. It's definitely not. That's not how that works. Okay. I'm gonna collect some wood, because you know you'll need plenty of that for a fishing pole. Let's go back over here. It's up there. I wanna go up there. I'm gonna go up there real quick. That's another fishing spot, isn't it? Yep, it is. We got a slime here. Another. How do I? Hello. 
Do I have to have, be barehanded to grab it? I do. What is that noise? What is that? Is that the spikes? Is that the spiky ones? Is that what that is? Oh, oh, another slime. Ooh, that one looks like it's sparkling. Oh no, it's just slime. It's just slime. Okay. We got some more wood here. I need fiber. So I want a gosh darn fishing pole. That's my goal for this entire part of this let's play is to just get a fishing pole. Tin ore. Peasant chest. Plus two armor plus four percent dodge chance. Oh, that's not that great, actually. Oh gosh, what the heck? We angered a spiky slime, which are apparently much more uh Mm -hmm. aggressive than regular slimes. Good to know. Okay, my bad. I didn't mean to anger it. I didn't even know it was there, to be honest. I do- oh, oh, oh. Ow, ow. Ow, spiky slimes hurt. Spiky slimes hurt. Good, good to know. Oh, there's some mushrooms over there. Some more slimes over here. I guess we'll go this way. I guess we'll go this way. Let me get my bridges really quick. Three. Four. Five. Okay. Collect some of these. I just, I really want to know how to fish. Okay, no, we're not going to eat that though, because that will do damage to my health, which I don't want. Oh, that feels like it's kind of a, tr a cheap trick. <laughs> Being able to hit it through the wall like that. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take that for sure, but that does feel a little cheap. If I'm being honest. So. Seriously, like, how do I get, how do I get fiber? There's more boxes over there. I need more bridges. Where can I get, no, I need more bridges. Puddings here. These, oh yeah, we did the puddings last time. All right, now we're gonna get some more health back. We're gonna go up here. Oh yeah, the talent points. I always forget about these. All right. Oh, we did have another mining point. Awesome. Another running point. Another crafting point. What does this do? Six percent chance to gain an extra item when crafting any wall, floor, bridge, or fence. Uh oh, very nice. Okay, so we want to come up over here. bridges over here. Get my sword back. Start breaking some of these boxes! Ugh. Now if I understand correctly, if you leave the slime on the ground, more slimes can form. At least that's my understanding of how that works. I know it's a lot of glow tulips, but I kind of just want to leave them there for the light. I think I'm gonna just dig out and see where it takes me, maybe? Well, we're getting ready to connect to something over here, which is partially probably where we've already been. Oh, look at that, more boxes. So that means there had to have been like explorers and stuff down here at some point, right? Because why would there be boxes just full of random stuff? What's going on here? So 
that like the edge. Can you not go any further than that? It's like a cavern. Oh no, it broke. It's interesting that you can still break the walls without a pickaxe. I guess I'm just gonna uncover this section and see. I mean, surely there's gotta be something, right? There has to be something along here. Can you build bridges over empty space? I don't, I don't know how much sense that would make, but like, can I put a bridge here? Oh. Interesting. Okay, you can. You can put a bridge there, just, you know, so in, in case you wanted to know. Yeah, that's something you can do. A new item, mechanical part. Oh, crude bomb. Oh, I did get some fiber. But from what? Was it from one of the boxes? So I have three fiber. That must be like a rare part. Okay. Okay, so I do have some fiber. I don't... I had to have gotten it from a box. Now, where are we? Where's my base? Oh my goodness. All right, we're going like way, way the wrong way here. Okay, let's go back. I don't exactly have the best sense of direction either, if you can't tell. Back up here, follow the little mini map. This is, this is what I should have done. What can we make at our crafting bench? Do I have to upgrade the crafting bench in order to get a fishing pole? So what do I need? Six copper bar and 15 tin bar? I feel like I'm a long way away from being able to get fishing pole, you guys. I'm, I feel like I'm a long way away from that. How do you get tin? I have two tin ore. Is it a random chance for dropping? Is that what it is? Is that why I'm not gonna be able to get the fishing pole this, this uh, session? I have a lot of copper bars. I could definitely probably get a full set of copper armor in case. All right, let's go back over here because there was a spot down there I wanted to try to get to, but I couldn't because I ran out of bridges. We're gonna go check that out. Maybe down here, this is where there was a whole section over there I wanted to try to get to. The Forgotten Ruins. Ooh, a new area. Is this tin or iron? Iron! Oh wow. These walls are harder to break too. Stone walls, that's why. So we have found forgotten ruins. I wonder what kind of creatures we'll run into here. I have a feeling I'm gonna go through my pickaxe quite a bit. Wait, is that gold? Gold ore? It said Forgotten Ruins, but I'm not really seeing much ruin. Oh, you need a drill, okay. I still need tin. I've broken my pickaxe. I think that's iron. I wonder if you, did I go the wrong way to get tin? Like, should I have gone a different direction? Let's go back this way then. Let's bridge our way over here, shall we? The clay caves. Ooh, we did find a new area. Is that the tin ore? Oh, so we have ran into tin ore. We have found the tin ore. It's in the clay caves. Okay, that's one step closer to where I need to be. Oh, oh, what is that? I have a full bag of junk. What don't I need? I definitely don't need sand walls. Okay, what is this? Grub? Kapok seed. Gives you fiber. Oh, nice. That gives you, it's a fiber plant. Okay, now I'm getting somewhere. The music has changed. Again. They, they really did such a good job. This music is so good. More tin. Yes. Awesome. Ooh. 
There be slimes. So far, the only things I've ran into are slimes. I haven't really, I keep accidentally killing the <laughs> lightning bugs, which is not my intent. Oh, 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 I have found more enemies. Oh, I died. Oh. No. Oh, no. Please tell me I didn't just lose all of If I just lost everything. Oh, no. I wasn't expecting to run into anything like that. Because <laughs> they've all just been slimes. Like... I guess I should have known better. I let myself get too complacent. <laughs> oh my. Oh, that's the, the bug. Oh. Those are a lot tougher than you would expect. And those hurt. Definitely, I want to make sure if I'm fighting one of those, it's, it's only one. It's kind of where I screwed myself over last time. So it does mark your spot of death. Oh my goodness, you are tough. I can kind of get it back. Huh, <sighs> okay. Dry hard bread, it feels like chewing chalk. Okay, so I didn't lose everything. Oh my gosh. I was terrified I lost all of that. So that's a thing. Oh, oh no, no, no. Oh. There's lots of buggies. Ugh. Oh, they're so hard to beat. Oh my goodness. <gasps> like, even with my copper armor, these guys are tough. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh no, 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 no. I do, I don't, I don't want, I don't want you. Please go away. Go away, please. Ow, ow, go away, ow, you hurt, you hurt. Oh my goodness, you hurt. <laughs> that hurts so much. A blood skull, oh wow, okay. Nice, okay, so worms hurt a lot, which is good to know. Uh, but it doesn't completely remove your stuff, which makes me very happy because I was very sad. I thought I was going to lose everything I had just worked for. Okay, that terrified me, but now I have 10. I need a bigger inventory already. Nope. No. Ugh, this is gross. These bugs are gross. And they're so tough. Even the little ones are vicious. Oh my gosh, I'm getting out of here. Okay. I have to go smelt some tin anyway. So, okay. Now we're getting back somewhere. There we go. Let's get, let's get back to where there's just slimes and I'm not gonna have to worry about worms killing me. Try to follow my mini map while also being in the dark. Did I mention I'm directionally challenged? Oh my goodness, it's a gigantic slime. Oh my.
That is massive. No. Oh my. Oh, Glurch the Abominous Mass. There's Glurch. We found Glurch. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay, Glurch. I'm going to leave you alone for now. Oh my gosh. Oh, I found it. Why do I always want to run and find things that I know is going to be able to kill me? Why do I do this? Why? Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it's terrifying. Oh, we found Glurch. That's, that's, I, I don't even know how I'm gonna, I, that's ridiculous. That's massive. I don't know how I'm gonna. Whew. Okay, let's smelt some tin. Now, how many copper bars? Six. Make the, the work table here, the better work table. There's our fishing pole. Oh my gosh, out of all of this, we finally got a freaking... And I didn't even need fiber. But I do need fiber for a backpack. Oh my. We get fencing, spike traps, a wood fence gate, a painter's table, an alchemy table, a tin anvil, carpenter's table, railway forge for creating underground rail systems. Okay, and then the iron workbench, which will obviously unlock more. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Okay, so we have our fishing pole. I'm so excited. That was the whole point of this episode. <laughs> the only downside is I have to put the basic one down to make any more chests, but that's okay. We have a fishing pole now. Awesome. I love it. Now, can you fish anywhere, or do you have to only fish in the little bubble spots? That's what I'm curious about. Let's go find a spot, because I know there are plenty. What can we get? How does fishing in this game work? Oh, so you have to like reel it in. I see, so it's like a mini game. And if you don't let it... Okay, so Orange Cave Guppy. Nice. All right, but I guess now the question is, can it be any spot? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, uh oh, oh. Oh, oh, and we lost it. Okay, so yeah, that it does have a mini game, a lot like Stardew Valley. Another orange cave guppy. Okay, I want to try one more. Oh, we got green kelp. Okay, so you can fish kelp. I am in love with these lightning bugs, by the way. So... So this is very much a... You have to probably learn the fish's patterns. To reel it in properly. A rock jaw. Ooh. A small shark that can break almost every material with one bite. Oof. Oof. Don't get bit by that. All right, guys. This is so exciting. We have access to fish now. Which means we have access to more recipes for cooking. And I'm overjoyed. Let's see what we can cook. It says valuable, but then it says it's not that useful. You can't cook with kelp. Let's do mushrooms and fish. Let's see what we get. I, I love finding out these new recipes. Orange mushroom soup. Nice. Okay. We're going to try you now. Let's see what we get when we combine it with a glow tulip. 
Glowing Guppy Filet. Ooh. Okay. All right. Now, Rock Jaw. Should we combine it with a... Ooh, maybe we can combine it with a Bomb Pepper. Let's see what the Rock Jaw and the Bomb Pepper make, shall we? This will be exciting. What is this? Is it something on a stick? What do we get? I'm excited to see. Spicy jawfish balls. <laughs> nice. 22 food. 2.5 health every second for 20 seconds. 15.9% melee damage for 5 minutes and 21% movement speed. Nice. I'm liking these recipes. I'm really liking the recipes. So we've got a couple of new ones. This is exciting. I'm so, I'm so happy I'm figuring this out on my own. Like, it makes me feel good that I didn't Google any of that. And I just ran into the stuff, to be honest. Like, it, it makes me very happy. Now, does that mean that's ready? Because I might be able to get a bed in this episode, too. So I do need to have the other workbench to get, also get the bed. So it's a good thing I didn't destroy it because... I still need my basic workbench. All right. Oh, everything's coming ready. Okay, we got a bed, everybody. Nice. Allows friendly inhabitants to move in if placed in a room to their liking. Oh, cool. So you can get inhabitants now, too. Oh, I'm making another chest while we're at it because I, I'm out of storage space. So we have a bed now and another chest. And it looks like I'm going to have to exp <laughs> expand my little hovel here. Okay, we now have an expansion. Still have two, but that's okay. And then I also need some floor. Because we just we just want some flooring on the ground here. We don't want to put our bed on dirt. Ah, okay. So there's... Oh, that's so cute. Look at that. Do you rest while you're in it? I'm curious. Yeah, so you gain health while you're sitting in the bed. I like that. Nice. Okay. And then we'll put the chest, uh, we'll put it at the foot of the bed. How about that? And we'll put, like, our decorative stuff here. So, like, these that don't really have any use right now can go in there. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. Awesome. So we got our little bed here. And we got our fishing pole, which was our goal. And we can fish now. And I'm so excited about that because I, I try to fish in every game that I play. I'm a fisher. So I, I got my fishing pole. I'm very happy. All right. So, yeah, I think that that's where we're going to call this section because I'm very happy that I, I got my... <laughs> my fishing pole and we caught some fish so now we have access to all types of food awesome so yeah we're gonna call it here for the day thank you so much for watching remember this is an early access so you can get it on steam now if you want to try it i don't know what we're gonna do next i got my fishing pole and now i kind of want to see what i need to do to beat glurch like can we beat glurch because it was that was giant that was gigantic so maybe next time we'll work our way up to try to beat Glurch. We'll see how that works out. All right. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you all later. Bye.